How many people have sold their soul to the devil for power? Sold their souls to the devil for money? Sold their everything? That, uh, they gladly give it over for a little something that they want so bad that will only last for a little while. It's going to burn. It's going to burn. Rattle, you perish with your money. Yes, yeah, Peter said, you perish with your power. Brother Miller just said, they're going to perish with unless they turn unto the Lord God. I've been a Christian 15 years. I've been a Christian 50 years. Don't tell me that. Have you? What does it take to be a Christian? And I'll wrap it up. How can I be saved? Oh, I just happen to have it. It comes right there. It's in the office there. A big stack of them. How can I be saved? Biblical. Realize I have sinned. For all have sinned that come short of the glory of God. Romans 3.23 Realize I cannot blot out my sins. Isaiah 64 6 says, But we are all as an unclean thing, and all our un uh, righteousness are as filthy rags in the eyes of God. Realize God has provided for your salvation, for my salvation. For God sent not His Son into the world to condemn the world, but that the world through Him might be saved. That's St. John chapter 3, verse 17, if you don't know. Realize we must accept the blood of uh, Christ for redemption. St. John chapter 1, verse 12, But as many as received him to them, gave he, being God, power to become the sons of God. Realize that to accept Jesus Christ, we must call upon the Lord and we shall be saved. Romans 10, 13. I must accept by faith the verse. Therefore, if any man be in Christ, guess what? He is a new creature. Did you get that? He is a new creature. Not the same one that don't go to God's house, that not the same creature that has no desire to learn of what uh, who he calls God, his Lord, not that he's no longer the same one that uh, has uh, nothing to do with God's people, but wants to do everything. Oh no, he's a changed man. Oh, he's no longer the same. So if somebody's the same, they still got that filthy mouth, there's a problem. You're not a child of God if you got that filthy mouth all the time. Well, you don't understand, preacher. I can't help it. You can help it. I had a filthy mouth since 1996. One word slipped one time. A-S-S. And it was out of context. That's why it bothered me. It just slipped right up out of the world, uh, right up out of the mouth. Stop me right there. God showed me right there. Don't have that problem. So if you have that problem, if you come into the Lord's house, and many people do, coming into the Lord's house, acting all goody-goody, and when you're out, you got a filthy mouth just like the world, don't expect God uh, to believe that trash. People won't say that. I will. Somebody's lying. Me or God. <laughs> it's not God. But people do that. There, uh, but as many as, uh, okay, therefore, if any, notice the word, any man, woman, boy, girl, if anyone be in Christ, he is a new creature. All things are passed away. Behold, all things are become new. Don't take my word for it. That's 2 Corinthians 5, 6. I cannot obtain peace and joy myself. This is God's gift to all. Who receive him. Now. There's only one way. There's all kinds. No doubt in my mind. They've got to be thousands if not millions. Of ways to go to hell. That was created for the devil. And his angels only. Or his demons only I should say. 
But there's only one way to get into heaven. And that is through Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God. All who come unto the Father will come by Him and through Him, or they won't be coming at all. Uh, Israel turned their back upon God, sold God out, if you will. Thank you, Lord, but... Uh, huh. It's just not enough. I think we're in the mood to start giving what you've given us, uh, give away what you've given us. Appreciate that, though, God. Let's just look at it for what it really is. Appreciate that, Lord, but I think we're going to give it to this man right here. I think we're going to set him up with what you gave us. Give him our sons, give him our daughters, give him anything he wants, pay him. And all of that breaks out everything it just continues to grow man's been in the way since day one you don't have to be a man out here in charge it could be the man that you look at when you look into the mirror man as always as we stand being in the way of God and yet for everything that man has done unto the Lord and against the Lord Look at what God still has done for mankind. Lord have mercy. God help us and God forgive us all for being so lazy and being having no desire. Lord, I, I pray, church, that uh, people's eyes wake up, that they wake up from their sleep. Because if they don't, they're in for a huge, massive awakening. And it will be too late. It will be too late. Where you at, sis?